Hello, and welcome back to Myth 2 Soul Blighter, you bastards! Today, we're going into the tank to see if you men have got the balls to take down the summoner! Monday, April 20th, inside the Tain. Once we were inside the Tain, the Deceiver explained its importance and what we must do here. I must admit I was somewhat distracted, however. This place is wholly outside of my experience. The air is cool and very dry and has a metallic taste. There are sections of cave wall that merge seamlessly with emptiness. Looking into these voids brings on feelings of nausea and I cannot shake the feeling that we are being watched. The Tain was supposed to be the final resting place of the Meacridia, but the summoner has been inside the shattered artifact for five months now, slowly resurrecting their entire race. To think of it makes me shudder. And even now the Meacridia spread across the province like fire across a dry field, leaving death and blackened ruins in their wake. We must stop him now. By all accounts, Soulblighter butchered the entire population of Strand looking for the summoner. How he knew where to look for him, or even how, is unclear. It is obvious that Soulblighter did not have access to the total codex. If he did, it would have led him right to the man. Instead, he tortured and killed nearly every living soul within three weeks' travel of that ill-fated city before finding him. The deceiver has brought us here to kill the summoner. The ruin he will bring about if allowed to remain alive is unconscionable. This alone dictates that he must die. All right, let's all thank our good friend Colonel Hauser for giving us that nice warm intro. So, like the man said, we're here in here the team. We're here to find and kill the summoner. Mission objectives also just want us to know that there'll be many obstacles and traps. And we're gonna keep our dwarves, and by the dwarves I mean at least a dwarf, by the way, and the deceiver. So I don't think you little buggers are safe. Level specific hints, just dwarves can pick up crystals, so that's why we need to keep them alive. Use dwarves to soften a mercridia. Yeah, thanks. I've handled a few mercridia in my time. Level specific hints, I think I got this. This is a fun trick to do. We're gonna do this. Okay, okay, clever, convenient. Hope me, maybe, maybe it'll be as cool as a lightning sword, huh? Who knows? And, okay, well, that's, that stinks actually, but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it, or burn it, or blow it up. Where is everybody? Aha! There is everybody. Okay. Well, if you notice, we actually have just as many guys as we had last time. Just different. And we have, well, actually we have an extra dwarf. And we have the old source of 500 poisons himself is the deceiver-ish thing. You know, I'm not really all that good at the rap game. We have a look at the tame, though, while we're just standing around. You know, we were here in the last myth, but ugh. This one in here is pulsating blackness for nothing. Yeah, I guess when we blew up the taint, it wasn't so good for the old girl, huh? Must have done some real permanent damage. Well, permanent damage or no, we got a job to do. So, let's get going on the said job, hmm? Aha! Not the little white crystal thingy, didn't it? Make sure we don't leave anybody. Hmm? Oops, keep doing that. Okay, so these are the little white crystals that the game was kind of mentioning earlier, and what is going on here? Roaming bands of Mucridia, hmm? Maybe one of them could be our friend. What do you think? Maybe the Deceiver can go get us a new friend. One never knows. After all, he is deceptive and slightly magical. Oh yeah, this guy's all ours, right? Well, nuts. New units received. That's what I'm talking about. Now we got some friends. Whoa. <laughs> In spite of having gotten some friends, 
They might be in some real trouble. Let me shoot that one. No, I don't want to shoot that one, huh? Well, the McCready are running away. I don't even know where they're going. I just know the deceiver just made one crumble. Sweet. And they ran back to another crystal. So at this point, you're probably wondering, what is up with crystals? Well, our main man B-Box here can go show us. As you can see behind us, there's this radiant barrier, and we can't walk through it. But once we get a crystal, our little dwarf goes on autopilot. Any minute now. Goes on autopilot, thank you sir. And he... Where is he going, anyway? The game's autopilot isn't so good. What are they doing with this guy? I'm not controlling him right now. The game is trying to run him around. It's kind of funny and sad. Beep. Oh, for the love. This is only happening because I'm trying to record this. Okay, you gonna do it now, buddy? There you go. Throws a crystal into the pit. And this little purple thingy pyramid got bigger. Which was a huge deal when this game came out. It was like deformable terrain? Never happened before. Heck, even now, you know, the Havoc physics engine is still pretty new, so... I guess that's sort of exciting. So obviously, we need another one. And equally as obvious, they've got one. So, why don't we go up there and see if they'd like to donate, hmm? Must be why they pulled back like a- oops, sorry guys. Maybe why they pulled back like a bunch of chickens. What now? And where'd our other dwarf go? Now I'm hoping we can get everybody together before they get pulled. And there are some fetch in here. Just like the game mentioned. You run around here, friend. Friend Mercridia. Okay. Let's see, move uh, Uber Jew into the middle. Maybe we can keep him a little safer there, huh? To fetch? Alright, let's rock and roll. Okay, so now we're gonna just try exactly what the level specific hints wanted us to try, which is let's go bag us some Mercridia. Pick a nice fresh one. New units received. Oh no, you go get him. Now, granted, he's probably not going to make it, but we're okay. With that. Casualty. Ah, oh, yeah, they didn't make it. Oh well. Oops, no, you shoot him. Actually, shoot him. Let's see if we can get the Deceiver in there. Now, the Deceiver can take most of the lightning for us. But luckily, he is a real lightning rod. We can back everybody else up because we don't want them to get lightning. Yeah, nice little withering dream. Okay, Xander, go grab us a crystal if you don't mind, friend. Looks like we lost our one Mercridia, but, you know, hey, distracted them, didn't it? Ah, stalagmite. That stalagmite, you know, I've struggled, actually, while filming. Because that stalagmite is, like, always in the way. Yeah. Hmm. Now, granted the damage the dwarf had, that doesn't look like a Mercridia swing. That looks a lot like an arrow. Like, somebody just sank an arrow right into his backside. But, you know, the good thing is that all of them, all of our uh, Heron Guard and our one McCree are actually uninjured. So this is a nice place to be. Yeah. All of our, uh, all of our melee are fully healed for once. Okay. Move now this Move little there. ambush is tricky, but I think we can pull it off. Hmm. Pretty guys get out of the way. Kind of want to stagger this out, as you may be able to imagine. Yes, sir. It's gonna be a nice little greeting squad what? for us when the I gate opens. Move here, move there. I don't know if that's far enough back, actually. So let's get a little further back. And there's one thing I never heard. It's a little yes, space. Sir. Okay, let's uh, let's move Xander in and take this thing over. Toss it, buddy. 
and uh, we don't want the deceiver to get blown up, so we'll stand him on the side. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And with that, poof, gate is gone. And now, whatever was back there is going to come and try yeah. to eat our faces. But luckily, we're used to things trying to eat our faces. Whatever those things may be. There they come. Things one, two, three, four, five. That's a lot of things. That may be thinking, why don't we take over a fetch? And uh, the answer is, um, hey, nobody asked you, okay? Do, do, do now. New units received. And just like that, a perfectly executed trap. Now let the deceiver go. Actually, I think a recruitia buddy is gonna do just good enough. <laughs> you guys stink. Okay, so there are two patrols out here. Dangerous. Very dangerous. But, uh, you know, things went pretty good for us. Nobody got injured. Blew up a lot of recruitia. Good times. Yeah. What now? So, with that in mind, let's keep moving. Get the archers up, because they take forever to walk. Mic up, young man. Same with the doors. Can't wait to get out of that stalagmite and or stalactite. We'll get the deceiver out front, because... Well, because he's got a lot of health, that's why. <laughs> Solve that problem. And, of course, the Mercuria. Always good to have them with us. Sander. So first we're going to go to the left because we likes it. Seaver is being lazy but we forgive him, don't we? We do. Maybe we should have sent them Recruitia first to uh, investigate, but, you know, hey. Oh, and speaking of which, actually, hold on a minute, everybody, everybody come back. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Dang it, the doors are going to be ineffective. This time around. New units received. I can't believe that Mercuria hit our guy. What a cretin. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Archer. But, you know, hey, time to move out. Oop. All of, time for all of you to move out. Get the doors moving. We picked up yet another Mercuria. Hooray. For us. And the Deceiver managed to not get all that messed up. So what's over here? Another stalagmite. I got it. Now, there was one of these little gateway thingies at the start, and uh, you notice I didn't even try to bring a crystal to it. Speaking of crystals, there's one. And the reason is because this one is broken. You can sort of see this big nothingness behind it. Uh, it's just creepy even looking at it, even today. So, so what happened with the tan anyway? Well, I think we messed it up, uh, we messed it up pretty good. Let's see, let's send our Mercuria over here to scout, but I'm pretty sure it's clear. So we'll have Broken Box go get it at the same time, but yeah, so if you remember from Myth 1, and they sort of alluded to this already, but the Tain was blown up by, um, by the Avatara, uh, two of the nine, Kuroi and Melden from, uh, from the first one. Yeah, no enemies over here. And when that happened, though, apparently we didn't destroy it entirely. We kind of knocked these weird holes in it. And I'm assuming that it must be easier to get into it now, for whatever reason. I don't know what that reason may be. But uh, hopefully it'll also be as easy to get out, you know what I'm saying? 
I mean, because... Who oh boy. I really hate to uh, be stuck in here again like we were last time. Much as I like to rag on the Deceiver, I don't think we can do without him. Oh wait, how are Mercredi doing? Our Mercredi have killed six of the bad guys. Thank you, Mercredi. Your easily shifting loyalties are uh, good times. Uh, I will just cut back in when the dwarves get back up here. Alright, so we're back. So we can see Broken Box has his little shiny. And we're ready to keep on keeping on. So let's do that. There was that other patrol up here somewhere. Not really sure where just yet. So let's go find him. Blew up the team. You know, one of the funnier things we leave oh there. You know, one of the kind of the funnier things about Ulrich is he is there they are. They appear to be stuck somehow. But not these guys. So there's another pet behind us, but I don't think they're gonna scissor us. One of the funny things about Ulrich, or Stranger Things maybe, is, you know, he doesn't, um, I don't know, he never, he doesn't seem to ever recruited any more of, uh, any more Avatara. Maybe they're hard to find, maybe they're rare, I don't know. What now? So, here's my idea. Let's go send a Mercredi up here to pull these guys, because he's fast. He's at least as fast as they are, huh? And now they're coming. Swell. Hmm. I think that'd be the guy to get. New units received. Archers don't do anything. Yeah, we got one of our McCurdy, huh? Casualty. Yeah, I guess they got a couple of them are Critia. Or three of them are Critia. Oh well. They're just Mercritia. No, no. We still got one. Sweet. And there's. Here's another defunct gate. But this is probably the gate we're supposed to be going to. Big shiny thing there. So, okay, that's what we'll do. Let's get moving. Let's regroup. I am sad that we lost a Mercritia though. Tisk tisk tisk. I'm just getting to like those guys. These guys haven't seen us yet. I guess that's convenient. <laughs> Come on, dwarves. Yeah, it was nice. It would be nice if we had more Avatar though, wouldn't it? Oh, the Heron Guard are holding up really well. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm willing to bet that we're probably... Where are the doors? Come on, buddies. We're probably going to have to go up there and figure out... What are we leaving behind here? Oh, a Mercuria. Shame on me. We're probably going to have to go up there. So we may as well get going. But who had the ball? B-Box. Why don't you go over there and drop it off, buddy? Funny that bit, Broken Box has actually been with us a long time. This is only his fourth mission with us. So, thanks for coming. Hooray. And the little thingy gets bigger. Let's try not to make that symbolic. Okay. So now we just need to get up there and see what's up with these guys, eh? Alright, so we're going to have to get up there and see where that other group what is, now? huh? Keep meaning to do that. Oh, oh, there they are right there. Let's see if we can get their attention. Fog them back a little bit. Yeah, up your mind. Without shooting lightning into our Mercridia buddy. Okay, hopefully this works. New units received. Don't call up the deceiver. 
guys don't do anything. We're about to really mess that guy up. Ha 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 ha! Success! Okay. Let's collect everybody. Let's put everybody back in the semi formation. Didn't have a chance to use the dwarfs there. Apologies to all the dwarf lovers, which I know there are many. But we did pick up uh, some more Recruitia, so hey. And also while we're at it, why don't we go ahead and heal up the Deceiver. Because although he can take a lot of shots, he can't take just an infinite number of shots. So there's no need to, you know, risk him like that. And now, spiders. Great. If you recall, there were spiders in the Tain originally. And by originally, I mean last time we were here. Let me punch these guys. Oh, no, this one. Yeah, so last time there were a bunch of spiders, and it was gross. Oops, let's stop. And for some reason, nobody wants to kill spiders today. I don't know why. Yes? Like, seriously, why are the archers not shooting them? Because there's millions of them. Oh, this is crap. Why aren't the spiders attacking them? The spiders should totally be attacking them. We're being robbed, people. Okay. I'll tell you what we're not getting, though. New units received. Almost lost an archer. Okay. Casualty. Last thing we want is for the dwarves to go nuts. Oops. Some pretty uh Luckily these spiders really aren't any kind of harm to us. They're just they're just awful because they're spiders and I hate spiders so much. Okay, well we lost one Mercury and we almost lost a Archer, crying out loud. Come back over here and heal him, would ya? See, we took a few lumps, but no biggie. You're lucky Archer. Not a whole lot of guys get to uh, be uh, healed with roots, huh? Okay. Now that we killed all of them, what do we get? Aha! Uh -huh. Nice little crystal. Yes? Well, let's get everybody down there and uh, let's go grab our prize, eh? And see if there are any more enemies while we're at it. There could be. Looks like there are tire tracks, doesn't it? A little bit. Strange. Tain is a very strange place. But also, Uberdu took a hit in there somewhere. Let him have the honor of getting a crystal this time. Uh, I don't think there's any more enemies though. So this may all be a bit of a waste of time. So the Mercridia in first. Our Mercridian infantry. And no. No more bad guys. So I tell you what, I'm going to make a little edit here and we'll be back at the gate with the crystal. See you in a minute. Now that we're back, Uberju is going to go drop off his little crystal that he picked up for us and then we can get on with it. Come on, buddy. There you go. Sweet. Okay. Let's get through this. Let us just get through this. In this next area, I'm going to try to get in a little bit of clearing for our archers. So far, I don't see any enemy though. Oh, no. There's, oh, there's a spider and a nifty little blue pyramid thingy. Great. 
Let's try to... Oh, this is kind of a high ground. We'll send the archers up here. Good a place as any for them. Keep everybody moving. It's a problem with the uh, going long distance. People tend to get in each other's way. But it's cool. So far. There's a lot of spiders. There's a whole lot of spiders. I guess this ground is nominally higher than the rest of the action. Put our doors up there. Spiders are kind of coming for us and kind of not coming for us. Not really sure what to make of it. I think they're trying to provoke us. And of course, one Heron Guard is above another Heron Guard, and it's just impossible that they move. Now right, let's go use our Mercridia to go harass these guys. See if we can kind of trip them, you know what I mean? Get the Deceiver over there. The nice thing about the Mercridia is they are fast. Boy, the spiders really don't want to get eaten. Boy, the spiders are fast. When did that happen? I swear they're going to hit the Mercuria. Finally got some. Well, if this doesn't get their attention, dwarves do not do anything. Why are you guys hesitating? Get in there. <laughs> Stupid archers are going to shoot each other. That's just their thing. I don't know why the archers do that. But they shoot each other all the time. Oh! Step aside. There's tons of them. <laughs> Stand clear. Yeah. I'll just turn the Mercridia loose. Yes. But seriously, don't do anything. Let the Saber pick that one up. Casualty. Oh, lost a Mercuria. That's fine. Casualty. Lost two Mercuria. Casualty. Lost all of our Mercuria. So oh, troubling. What makes them so awesome? Let's reconvene the archers. Oops. We got a lot of stuff coming. Let's see. And turn the dwarves loose, I suppose. At least two of them. Oh, yeah. well, there's something about these things that just doesn't. Yeah, dwarves. Uh oh. Are they coming behind us? Get him, get him, get him. I don't know why, but they're just not tripping our range here. Okay. Lost. Uh, well, we lost all of our Mercridia, but I think it was worth it. Is that everybody? Boy, that one archer almost got nailed. Why don't we heal him up, huh? I just know there's other archers shooting him, though. But there's no dead bodies around. Archers are really the worst when it comes to that sort of thing. The Deceiver can just go pick this up on his own. Disappointingly enough, this is the artifact that's meant for the Deceiver. No lightning sword. Just this little blue pyramid majigger. It does have a pretty cool effect though, you will uh, you will see it in a minute. Punk. And now he's got it. Oops. <laughs> I gotta stop doing that. I wonder how many spiders that was. Because it seems like it was like a bazillion. Where should we go next? Oh. Oh, pillar dealies. That's interesting. Well, let's go ahead and run everybody over there while the deceiver is catching up to us. Yeah, pretty mysterious looking. I'll have to go check that out, huh? Just need to form up the archers. Yeah, the dwarves. May as well form the dwarves. 
Get that saver over here. Pretty big map, all in all. It's funny that this saver only has one campaign with us, but the flavor text has been implying that he's been doing quite a few, uh, quite a few little missions for us. So now I'm gonna show you a little trick really quick, and then as you'll see, I will cut back here. So to perform that trick, let's go form up the Heron Guard and see what's up with these little monolith things, huh? Get in there, boys! <laughs> where, where, where? Get them, boys! All right. Enough with my terrible impressions. Uh oh, glowing yellow. Never a good sign. Casualties. Boom! Holy Casualties. crap! We're not even gonna make it, are we? Yeesh! That was a mess. Let's not do that. Right, good thing that didn't happen. Let's send in the receiver first and see if, uh, no. Let's send in the receiver first and see if this little pyramid thingy is gonna do something for us. Yes, sir? Uh oh, we're glowing. And the guy's got a lot of health, but uh, I don't know. Ah, a little pyramid thingy with a lightning rod. Yes. No, we're not taking any damage. Good. Let's just quickly run everybody through this little gauntlet. Just hope this little lightning thing doesn't wear off. I don't think it can hurt us, but we're not gonna stand near it. We're just gonna. Whew. Yeah, so we wouldn't have had to kill all those spiders except that we really needed that little light. And nobody's getting hurt, so that's always positive. What I got up here? Lion and Mercuria and one of their ginormous piles of skulls. I don't know what they're doing. Let's see, before we get in there, we may as well use up our uh, See. I could heal a deceiver too. I wonder if this is going to let you feel us to death. Time will tell. Swords are conducted, you know. Nope, no damage. Okay, well, let's move the deceiver out there. Let's get ready to fight this battle. Oh, deceiver has gone on autopilot on us. I don't know what that means, but it's probably not good. Where is he going? Archers, get ready to do your fire arrow trick, hmm? Ready. Next up here is... The Summoner. Total douche. Insolent whelp, your deeds gather to you not glory but suffering and death. You dare threaten me right here? To be fair, that is Looney Tunes. New units received. Oh, let me pretty go get him. Of course, stop that. Stop it. Let's get him. Cut him down. Withering dream, baby. Yeah, that's how we roll. And teleport ski. We're out of here. Alright, victory, baby. Although, to be honest, the screen doesn't really look a whole lot like victory, does it? We seem to have popped right up next to our old buddy Soul Blighter. And, uh, that can't be good. But, even if it can't be good, we still managed to do some serious damage this time. Our Heron Guard turned in 38 kills, no casualties. Recridia, quite valuable this time. 32 kills, although 7 of them bought the farm. Bowman took out 22, the dwarves got 10. And, uh, 
And I don't know how many the deceiver got, but uh, he got some. So, damage is pretty evenly split, really. I mean, Herengard, Mercridia, Bowman, they all did their piece. Dwarves got a little bit of the action. Our heroes are kind of the same because we've just been keeping everybody alive as much as possible. 113 kills total, 63 of those uh, disgusting spiders, 39 of the Mercridia, 10 fetch, and 1 the summoner. So, now that we took out the source of his Mercridia, I imagine Soul Blighter is not going to be all that happy with us. Let's find out what happens when we, when we I guess maybe we're going to confront Soul Blighter right here right now. Who knows? Find out next time on Let's Play Myth 2, Soul Blighter.